Hey you guys, I've got my timer ready. We're gonna do a 10 minute intense lower ab workout, real time. Get ready. Hey you guys, so we're gonna do a 10 minute intense lower ab workout today. I have five different exercises we're gonna go through. We're gonna do 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest, we're gonna do two rounds per exercise. So once we finish that first exercise, we're gonna enjoy that 15 seconds of rest, and then, then we're gonna repeat the exercise. Once we've done that, we'll go on to the next one until we're done with all five. All righty, at any time, if I feel like there's something critical that I need to talk to you guys about, I might just uh, take a break for a second to just maybe explain something, but please keep going. I just, sometimes I feel like I need to stop. It's hard to talk and exercise at the same time, but I, there are certain points that I may want to talk to you guys about to just watch out and make sure you have the right form. Okay, so the clock is going to be ready. We're just going to be on the ground for the first one. This is going to be a weighted tricycle. You can use um, your body weight. You don't necessarily have to have it weighted. You can use a light plate, dumbbell, books, whatever you may have, if you if you like. Okay, so here we go, and we're off. Okay, so with these, I usually just put the plate on my chest. The tricycle, all we're doing is we're just bringing our knees up to our chest. This is a great one to kind of just get those deep core stabilizers awake, or the transverse abdominis. So we're just kicking those knees up. If you want to do one round weighted and the second round not weighted, A-okay, however you want to do it. Just kicking and lifting. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, enjoy your 15 seconds. It won't last very long. <laughs> All right, I love these because I feel like they kind of just wake things up. Whew, okay. And off we go. Second round, bringing those knees up. Having the plate here, why I'm using this is because it just makes it harder for me to lift my chest up. So if I were to take this away, then this is just your basic tricycle. You're just gonna have kind of your hands down to your side and you're just gonna kick your legs up. So, oh yeah, they're burning already. Three, two, one. Okay, 15 second break. Okay, now we're gonna go into a large med ball crunch. Just gonna put my shins on the med ball, and then I'm just gonna draw my abs in. And here we go. Back to a straight back. Probably thinking about keeping my core engaged the whole time so I'm not slumping down. Whew, these are good. Keep going, I know it's hard. My hands, right? Ooh. Just think about really crunching with that lower ab. We got five seconds out. Woo! Yeah, those are tough. All right. Yeah, just really think about just drawing that lower ab in with these. All right, and we're off again. My shins are on the ball. I'm just drawing those knees in. to just stop and hold like this for a second. I know these are tough, it's okay. 
Just get your shins back on. And just keep pulling that ball in, extending out. Okay. Whew, brutal. Okay, sliders. You're gonna grab your sliders or towels. You're just gonna put them under your heels and you're just going to pull your body in, press out. Try to get your hips under your arms and extend out those hips to the ceiling. Make sure you breathe. Whew, these are some shoulder work in here too. Keep pulling, we're almost there. I think we're 10 seconds out. Press out and rest. Whew. So if you don't have sliders, remember you can use towels. Whew. Keep breathing. All right, and we're back at it again. With your hands, they should be facing forward. I forgot to explain that earlier. Hopefully they were already. Just bringing those hips under. And straightening out. Also for beginners to make this a little bit easier, if you prop up your upper body, let's say if you had a small, uh, like a small stepper, that's gonna help you actually bring your hips through a little bit easier. Okay. Next ones are a little bit harder. You're gonna need a mat. We're gonna do a roll back break dancer. So, you're just gonna start here. You're going to kick your feet up towards the ceiling to engage that lower abdominal. You're going to pop up, if you, even if you have to use your arms like that. You're going to kick through on each side. You're going to roll back, kick feet up towards the ceiling. If you can roll out of it, great. If you're like, I can't roll out of it, what do I do? Cross your legs, cross your feet like this, then jump here. It's a little Beginner tip, so we're gonna press up, come here, kick out. Push up, and kick out. Okay, take your break. Whew, these are a little bit more intense. <laughs> All right, I know that roll back can be a little tough. Use the momentum, you guys. Okay, we're gonna kick up, come up, kick through, and back here. Kick out. Kick through. It takes a lot of lower abdominals for that one. And kick through. Whew. And 15 seconds. Okay, the last. You can grab a pillow, a ball. Something can be a light item. Something to hold in your chest. A plate, a dumbbell. You're gonna think about squeezing those together. This is an adduction kick out. We're just going to, we're gonna think about squeezing that together as we're lifting our chest. Whew. Sorry, my pants are buckling in the back here. Okay. So just bring your knees to your chest. I'm thinking about squeezing 
Let's pull together. Makes it actually engage. The more you squeeze, it works the adductors, the inner thighs, but it also engages the lower abdominals. Whew. Take a breather. We're in our last 45 seconds, you guys. Get this ready. And off we go. Don't forget to squeeze. We're not just holding it. For a second, Whew. we're really working those muscles. Okay. Keep breathing. We're almost there. I think I can do it. <laughs> we're not. And we're done. Whew. Alrighty. Whew. Okay, you guys. Nice little workout you can do either at the gym or at home. Not a ton of equipment is needed. Whew. If you want to make that even tougher, you can make that a 20 minute workout. Just do your exercises four rounds. Or to make it even tougher, you can do one minute rounds with no rest. Whew. Well, thanks for joining me, you guys. Hey, make sure to follow us on social media. We're posting great workouts, different exercise tips, diet tips, all on our Facebook and Instagram pages. Check out Athlean XX for Women. If you haven't checked out our Max Shred program, there's another great new program that was just put out. Super customizable with your workouts and your diet, which is, can't get any easier than that. Thanks for joining me, see you guys soon.